video for you guys. This is a CR125. It's by Honda. It's a 95. She's gonna get a new top end on her. And she was a little sluggish on takeoff, but might have been because she had 100, 100 PSI. But anyways, this video is gonna be about me showing you guys the power valves on this little CR125. Okay, so basically you got your, your rod right here that controls with the governor. And when your engine's off and no RPM on the engine, this is on the position that's up. When this is up, both valves should be exposed in there. See those two valves in there? Okay, now let me actuate them. So, as RPM picks up, these valves get pulled out. This, this rod will get pulled down and the valves are not seen anymore. That's at 3,000 or more RPM. So that's the way it is. So you know automatically that if you look at your cylinder and those valves are not shown and this is in the up position, not down, but up, then you know you got something wrong. And to be honest, these were not very hard to uh, to adjust. The adjustment is to loosen up this bolt and push them in. Put some tension on here and then retighten it. It wasn't very hard at all. So I'm gonna send this off to Millennium Technologies and have them, I think that's plating that I see in there. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna send it off to get repaired. So quick little video for you guys that got some questions. See that? They should always follow each other. When one comes out, the other comes out. And that's it.